so I'm talking to this Olympian the other day, and he's like, what do you, what's your goal with the you? what's your goal? And I was like, oh man, I've already got what I want. It's a beautiful thing. I'm happy with it. Happy with where we've, we've ended up. And I'm just trying to live a more joyous and harmonious life. Whatever that means. I'm 37 years old, kind of downshifting off of the long distance triathlon kick that I've been on, an obsession, a myopic obsession into the abyss of qualifying for Kona. And I don't know if I'm ever going to get there, but that goal is seeming to subside emotionally. And I'm making room for other goals. I think maybe, maybe one day I'll have a family. Who knows? 37. Pushing 40. What's up with the tree? You, you know, back to that question. What are your goals? I think for so long, I've been so goal oriented that I forget to stop and just experience each day as a beautiful situation. I've tried to reevaluate my goal to make each day special. How do I do that? Because in a way, it feels like giving up, being peaceful, being content, being joyous and harmonious with nature. And our mind seems like giving up on some of these societal goals of growing and, and everything. It's weird. It's weird. It's weird me out. And I experience these periods of like, you're kind of a failure. If you're not growing, you're dying, right? I don't know. Again, I always come back to my deepest goal is to be content, fulfilled, and gracious. Why does it have to be so complicated? This, this race, this race, this Kona thing, man, it had just had such a hold on me over the years. And now it seemingly does not have a hold on me. So what's gonna happen after this Iron Man that I'm signed up for in late April. When it's done, I really don't plan on putting another race in the cart at that distance. It's like, what do you do? How do you reevaluate this? How do you reevaluate re like the thing that's that's given so much? It was like point A to point B. Point B was Kona and Boston Marathon, run like all this stuff. That was the goal. Point A was where I am. Point B was where I wanted to be. But in the kind of the path of getting to point B, started a shoe company, I met my wife, moved to Austin, made friends, traveled the world, done all the stuff, and it's like, how important is from getting from point A to point B? And, and it's something I've been thinking about a lot lately. Don't be afraid to reevaluate your goals. It's not being a failure. If you don't make it to Kona, you're not a failure. That's what I tell myself. Have fun with it. So am I more in touch with my new goal, which is to live a joyous and harmonious life in the present? I don't know, but I'm trying. And I like it. Focusing on being cozy, man. Got some lights, some mood lights. Got my new lamp. Don't be afraid to reevaluate your goals. It's okay. It hurts. Feels like sometimes it can have feelings and emotions associated with changing your goals. That's cool. Don't worry about that part. It's okay if you screw it up. It's just what happens along the way. Don't be afraid to stop and smell the roses. Maybe it's time to evaluate what you've been given and be grateful for that. Like it's so easy to miss. That's all I've got.